you're new to buying cigars, you want to frequent a shop that the attendant or the tobacconist knows what they're selling you. They can answer questions about the cigars, ask questions about, about the strength, about where it comes from, even, even get into what, what's in the blend. They should know those answers. They should be able to guide you based on your taste, your preferences, what you've tried in the past. They should be able to guide you into, into a smoke uh, if you're looking to try something different. If you're looking to just buy your same old cigar that you've, that you've tried, what you like, obviously look for uh, problems uh, with freshness. Look around the humidor, make sure that, they're, that it's properly taken care of, that it's clean, that it's maintained. Cigars aren't cracked or damaged. Kind of some basic fundamentals. A popular misconception is that a cigar that costs more um, is a better cigar. The, the price reflects how much time went into the creation of that cigar. Some cigars are aged a minimum of three to five. You could go up to 10 to 12 years. That's a lot of aging that that cigar has to be handled. The tobacco, the cigar, it's all handled by hand. That brings the price up. You may find that that $5 cigar, you may enjoy it better than the $20 cigar. Price shouldn't dictate your, your uh, purchasing. Finding the right cigar for you is a matter of a little bit of experimentation, trying different cigars, experimenting with the different blends. Once you find your taste, you can generalize the blend. You find out the, the blend, you can gravitate towards cigars of like blend and that's, a, that's the best place to start.